In today's video, we're checking out a Bixby that won't send your guitar out of tune. This is the Game Changer Audio Bixby pedal. I love the fact that the Bixby isn't a one-trick pony. We can use this as an octaver, a pitch shifter. By setting up these three controls on the top here, we can dial in a great sounding optical tremolo, chorus, or vibrato sound. One of the cool things about this pedal is you can run it on automatic mode, or of course you can use it with your foot like this. You can control it both forwards and backwards and control which way you want the pitch to go. So you can either have it down or up using this one and same with this way. Game Changer audio pedals come out of Latvia and it's an absolute tank of a design. I would have no problems recommending this in terms of build quality. A massive thank you to Game Changer Audio for sending this out. If you want to check it out, I'll link it down in the description box below. Here we go. First up, I wanted to showcase some of the rhythm tones I got in the intro track. So what you're about to hear is the Bixby pedal going into my Fender Blues Deluxe Reissue amplifier on the clean channel. And the reverb is thanks to the Crazy Tube Circuit's White Whale Spring Reverb. That's awfully hard to say. Anyway, you're gonna hear some traditional tones. So as I push down on this, it will lower the pitch. As I release, it'll come back up. <laughs> things about this pedal is you don't have to use your foot you can simply set it to automatic mode just by adjusting the rate blend and depth controls i've dialed in a really cool chorus tone on the clean channel let's have a listen <laughs> One of my favorite modulation effects ever is tremolo, and this does a beautiful optical tremolo sound. It really feels good under the fingers. Here we go. <laughs> I'm next going to show you just how well this tracks when it comes to transposing chords. So I've just dialed in the pedal to go from a D to a C chord just by using this control here. Up next I want to show you how you can use this pedal as a full-blown octaver. <laughs> When it comes to functionality, you can use this however you like. Up next, I'm gonna show you how to pitch up from the octave that you're at by pushing down like this. On the back of the pedal here, there's an invert switch. You can switch it this way and have up be down. I'm gonna start with the Bigsby in the down position, transposing up to a D from an A chord. I'm gonna play an A chord the entire time, but you'll hear a D and an A just by using this, and it tracks beautifully. A 
I've just dialed in the Bixby, so as I do a full press, it's giving me a couple of octaves up from where I'm starting. This is great for those funky kinds of riffs. Now, if I had an external foot switch, I could actually lock this into position just by using an external controller, so I don't have to just keep my foot pressed down. I don't have one of those, but if you wanna check out the Game Changer Audios video, it's a great run through. I'll link that down in the description box below. <laughs> Another effect this pedal is capable of is vibratone or vibrato. This sounds great, both clean and dirty, kind of reminiscent of that cold shot kind of vibe. Here we go. <laughs> Let's wrap this video up. I wanna give you my thoughts about the Bigsby from Game Changer Audio. Build quality wise, this is phenomenal. It feels unreal under the foot. The spring feels secure. I would have no problems recommending this in terms of build quality. I only have one small critique with this. If you don't have it affixed to a pedal board straight away, it's gonna slide around the floor a lot, especially if you're seated and playing. This is best used if you're standing up without a pedal board, but my suggestion is put it on your pedal board and it won't move around and that problem is then solved. Secondly, this pedal will take a few days to get comfortable with, learning all the controls, learning what it can do, and then getting used to actually using the Bigsby itself, which is unlike any wah pedal I've ever used. I've been using wah pedals for years and get on any wah pedal and make it work. This challenged me to no end at the start, but after a few days, I was then far more comfortable using it. So I think it sounds great. Let us know what you think in the comments. Being that the Bixby can work as an expression pedal or work in conjunction with a foot switch which can hold some of the effects down to save you from having to physically push down once you find a sound that you like, it opens up a lot of opportunities. If you wanna get a full rundown of this pedal, I'll link to Game Changer Audio's video in the description below. And if you wanna check this out, I'll link it down in the description as well. Thanks again for watching. Let us know what you think. I'm gonna put this in the best of 2023.